first of all we will do the lab and then we will uh, try to understand how actually bridge network work so uh, before doing lab uh, we have um, if you want to enable bridge uh, interface on your VMware, then you have to check your physical NIC card so i just press ctrl r to open run command and press and type ncpa dot cpl here you can see the our vm uh, interface and physical interface if you are using a laptop then obviously you will get the wi-fi adapter in here so in my pc i am connected with ethernet cable so double click ethernet go to properties and um, you have must enable this option okay if you don't check mark this vmi bridge protocol then your bridge protocol will uh, not work so i just click ok and close so now how to assign a bridge network on your vm so go to edit virtual machine settings and here uh, i have already bridge network if you don't have you just uh, check the bridge if you want to more if you don't have network adapter then you have to add in here add a network adapter and finish after added network adapter you can choose which network adapter type you need so i already have bridge network that's why i delete my net adapter now okay now i'm opening my vmware pc So login with the actually after login my uh, Ubuntu VM we'll check which ip address we actually got it so wire setting this is my vm ip uh, this ip get from my uh, physical router physical home router so for your clarification we i am going to log in with my physical router let's see one nine two one six eight ten dot zero slash twenty four block on my physical router so actually how the bridge network work bridge network actually work as your physical uh, network uh, all behavior are same as your physical network and of course your physical network ip subnet and your vm ip subnet will be same that's why uh, you can ping each other
now here is the bridge network diagram so we have got it this subnet block of ip on our vm and our pc subnet block is same that's why you will be able to communicate with either each other directly without port forwarding and this type of technology so you can ping vm from your local pc all and outside of the internet you can also use internet and of course your physical your physical machine will also be able to communicate with uh, vm inside the vmware vm so that's why there is a two-way communication now let's check uh, is it actually work now i open my terminal and do the ping 8.8.8 ping 8.8.8 so that we can ensure our we are receivable to the internet now i'm going to my physical piece laptop so that we what is my ip okay. this is my laptop and it's connected with wi-fi and my laptop uh, ip is 10.21 so just i'm going to here and do the ping being 192.168.10.21 this is my laptop's ip so uh, we are able to reach internet as well as our physical machine that is attached on my uh, physical network let's check my physical uh, computer uh, is able to communicate with vm machine okay so ping 192.168.10.69 that was my vm ip i'm going to show you from my gui Yes, this is the 69 IP.